Hey, hey, be careful what the words you're saying. Almost done the tech level. as to what I'm sleeping on. It's called a tatami mat. I've been sleeping on it for like the past month now, but I'm not gonna lie. I think I need to go back to a regular mattress because it's not bad sleeping on the tatami mat. I got inspired from Japanese culture to do it. I just like had a vision one day and it was telling me, my, you need to sleep on a mat. I tried it for a month. It was fine. But I think I'm realizing that I'm a side sleeper, not a back sleeper. What am I gonna wear, first of all? Like I'm late and I'm trying to explain like what a tatami mat is. I'm gonna wear this set from Set Active. It's this gray one, very cute. Also, I wanna mention, I've been trying this thing called period underwear and it's not actually underwear it's literally like a diaper and i know you guys are gonna make fun of me but listen i have not gotten one leak one stain or anything this whole time it's actually great yes i'm wearing basically a diaper but like it's not actually a diaper okay like it's not thick on this like that this is my tatami mat i bought it off of amazon if you guys want to try it i don't recommend it though i mean i do recommend it but i just don't think that anyone should do this to themselves unless they're crazy anyways i'm gonna change into this then we gotta get going because i have to take sterling to the groomers today and then i also gotta go on a run and then have a pilates class at nine. Oh my god welcome back to your productive day in my life Oh my gosh, and look at that, she's changed. Crazy editing, right? That, that was magic. The fact that I have a stool in my bathroom because I can't stand and put my clothes on or my socks on. It's giving senior citizen. Y'all, the weekend, I've done nothing. And not like saying, oh, I've done nothing to be like relatable. Like, yeah, guys, like watch me get my life together. Like yesterday, I took two naps. The day before, I took two naps. And not just like regular naps. Like the day before that, I took a nap at 10 a.m. And then I also took a nap at 8 p.m. Yesterday, I took a nap at 9 a.m. and then I took a nap at 12 o'clock and then I just sat on the couch and watched Instagram reels all day and just organized my reels folder. So it was somewhat productive, but it was definitely not on the to-do list. But you know what, guys? It's okay. It's okay. Everybody has those days. Everybody gets that way. Sometimes I'm in a gym. I gotta make a plan, but life gets crazy. Facts. Life do be crazy. Sometimes I'm like, why am I doing so many things at once? And then I'm like, no, my, you can do all these things. Like you're meant for it. And then I'm, I, I do all the things. And then I'm like, what the. What am I doing? Why did I sign up for this? But whatever, you live and you learn. And my thing is, I'm like, I'm literally running a whole ass clothing line. Like, it's not, it's not merch. It's not merch. I'm running a whole clothing line where I have to do the socials. Well, I get to, I get to. We gotta rewire our brain to like positive mindset. I get to do the socials. I get to do the whole website. I get to do a bunch of photo shoots. And I'm like, I just made this hoodie because I thought it was a really, really, really good hoodie. I didn't know what would go into it. Now my main priority is making clothes and not making YouTube videos. And babe, that cannot happen. Why don't you stick to the thing you're naturally good at? How come my drops on July? 21st. There's spam account exclusive access where you get early access if you guys want to follow the spam account, but you guys don't have to. It's just that I don't know if it's going to sell out because the last time I did the exclusive spam account thing, it sold out and then it created this whole issue where everyone that bought it on the main account a week later got it shipped out a month later because we sold out of all of the hoodies that we already made. So then once the main account, when I say the main account, like the My Family Instagram account went to buy it, we already sold out of all of the stock that we had in the warehouse. So we had to make more. It was definitely a Show. I was crying every single day because I had a really good problem. Ugh, I should wash my face. I also gotta organize my closet, organize my bathroom. Like, it's like, okay, it's not like clean to the max, but it's just that, you know when you just have a lot of stuff and it's like not in the places that it needs to be? Because that's where my house is at right now, where there's just a lot of stuff and like, it's just, I don't know what's in my house and that stresses. No, I'm not gonna say that. Hey, hey, hey. Be careful what the words you're saying. I think that it could be cleaner. This is the Nutritious Estee Lauder 2-in-1 cleanser, by the way. It's the only cleanser I've been using for the past month. I just like it because the way it foams. And then I'm also going to go in with the Kiehl's Ultra Potent Hyaluronic Acid. Hyaluronic Acid is probably my favorite skincare product just because it's not harsh on the skin at all. Like, it's literally there to moisturize your skin. I'm not no dermatologist, but I'm pretty sure everyone can use it, whether you have acne-prone skin, dry skin, oily skin. It's just a really good product. Stairs are a workout every day. Okay, okay. Sterling sneezes whenever he needs to go outside. Go, go, go. Oh. It's warm out, Sterling. It's actually really warm out. Good morning, USA. I got a feeling that it's gonna be a wonderful day. The sun in the sky. 
This is now sun in the sky. Go boo! I have like a garden upstairs. I want to go get more planters so I can plant like mint, basil, all oh, that shebang. <laughs> Amazon boxes and all the stuff at the pool table. I need to organize, but overall, it's not looking too bad. Sterling, can you eat? I need to take him to the groomers right now and he won't eat. It's because it's like kibble, because I just got back from travel, so I don't have any farmer's dog left, but he likes his farmer's dog, not his kibble. I've been drinking a glass of water every morning when I wake up, and I know that's so cliche, but guys, I think water is good for you. Also, if you're feeling like, oh, you don't know if you're bored or you're actually hungry, have a glass of water first and see. Because I only say this because I'm somebody that loves to bored eat. I'm somebody that loves to go on Instagram, see food, and be like, let me go there right now. Let me eat this right now. Even though I could have ate 10 minutes ago. Having a glass of water really makes me think I feel like it makes me listen to my body a little bit more. I've been trying to listen to my body more and what my body's telling me right now is that I shouldn't go on a run and I should just go to Pilates today. But I don't know if that's the L-A-Z-Y in me or if that's me listening to my body. But I'm just gonna say it's listening to my body because the fact that I was huffing and puffing and going up those stairs really says something. First workout in a couple days. Maybe we'll take it slow. We don't need to jam pack for a day because I don't know about you, but I have this tendency where I love to do nothing. And then the day that I feel motivated again, I'm like, let's do everything. I'm gonna change my life. But that leads to burnout very fast. Okay, before we head out though, I need to grab a hoodie. Hmm, which one are we gonna pick? Alchemy, Alchemy. Alchemy or Alchemy. Definitely Alchemy. This is one of the new collections. It's like the first sample though, so there's gonna be some changes to it. Like the hue of this blue is gonna be this blue right here. And like this star is gonna be smaller. We have to go through like, I would say three rounds of samples before we finish. And that's just like on the graphics and everything like that. Just because the hoodie is already a base that we already custom made. Like the fabric is custom milled fabric. It's very soft on the inside. And then on the outside, it's like more, it's still soft, but it's like a different material. But that way you're still nice and warm and cozy. I had a Subscribers say that she wore this like in minus 40 in Canada underneath a jacket and it was so nice and cozy And I say same I spent the winters in Canada this year and all I was wearing was Alchemy If you guys are wondering what size this is, this is one size I would say that Alchemy fits size small to 2XL Definitely a true XL, but if you guys can see these wings here, it's like a custom pattern too Good morning, Maya Good morning, girl. She just came from upstairs And then the hood, oh my god The fact that I'm wearing a ponytail, okay And the fact that I can still put this hood on and it's still a hood is crazy Boom, look at that. And you can pull it down. What is this? The onion. Macro. You just grew this outside? Yeah. Oh, wow. High five. Okay, Sterling, ready to go with the groomers? Let's go. Look at this little guy. Oh my gosh, he loves bike rides. Ready? Ready? Let's go. Oh. Okay. Thank you guys so much. Thank you. All right, just like I'm to the groomers, now we are going to go into the city, into Manhattan, and we're gonna go to Pilates. Let's head over. I just arrived at the Equinox, parked my bike. I've never gone to this Equinox before, but I used to live in this area and this Equinox is literally like five minutes from my old place. I don't know why I never came to this one, but I'm here 25 minutes early, so I'm gonna sit, journal, probably get a juice. All right, I just journaled. I wrote, good morning. I'm so proud of myself for getting up and going to Pilates today. I am going to have an amazing, wonderful, and incredible day. I obviously wrote more, but y'all don't need to see that. I'm currently at this place called Pause Cafe. I've come here a couple times, but I've never gotten like actual food. So I'm really excited to eat. This is called sh 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 it's called something. It's like onion, egg, it has tofu, tomatoes, all of that stuff, and like herbs. So I'm really, really, really excited to try this. And then this is just like a salad, which she's really good. Now let's try this tomato. Oh. Burn me, bro. She's hot. She's steaming. Mm -hmm. It's good. It's very simple, though. I think I was expecting more flavor. Time is currently like 11 o'clock, though. I'm probably gonna head home, pick up Sterling soon. Thank you. You're so cute. Aw, thank you. Thank you, too. Ugh, I got home like an hour ago and I haven't been doing anything, bro. You know what I want? Popcorn. I got this popcorn machine and honestly, it is the best purchase that I've ever made. I love popcorn. It is my favorite snack. 
Now we wait. Just like that. We have popcorn. Grab my little bag. It's literally three o'clock and I've done nothing. Well, it's not, I haven't done nothing, okay? I don't know. Today is like a rainy day and it's just weird, but I'm gonna shower because it probably stay. And typically I like to like go two weeks without showering, but I don't think that that's a good idea. I'm gonna shave and do the whole nines because, you know, what if I see a boy in some night? Just kidding. I don't shave for boys. What? Like I actually don't. Cause like, I just don't care. Like you're in the presence of me. Like what? That's the last thing you should be worried about. Like what? Anyways, but I'm gonna shave though because I low key want to smell good. Not low key. I like always would love to smell good, but just sometimes it's like a lot of work. Y'all better not say something about me being stinky. <sighs> I'm like, do I want to do like a whole new shower routine or do I want to do the bare minimum right now? Bare minimum. This portion of the video is sponsored by EOS. Okay, it's smooth glossy, so we're gonna be using the EOS J Better 24 hour moisture cream. You guys already know that I use the lotion all the time, but I'm literally going on vacation in less than a week, so I wanna make sure I'm nice and shaved. I know I said it as a joke earlier, but I literally don't shave for no boys or nobody. I shave for myself, okay? But as you guys know, I literally just started moisturizing my skin the last year, like using lotion. I know. Don't make fun of me, okay? I never grew up with my parents telling me to lotion, okay? I was ashy my whole life. But whenever I shave, sometimes my skin gets dry if I like don't use shave cream because sometimes I'm crazy, but using this makes sure that my skin is like moisturized for like 24 hours or something like that. And I also use it in combination with the lotion and stuff. But this has like really rich shade in it. I mean, duh, it's in the name. I'm sure you guys can hear and like read. You know, it says here shea. And this just protects against like razor bumps, razor burns, irritation. But this is gyno tested and everything like that. So you can use it like lower than just like your bikini line, like you know, like down there. The fact that I'm literally just like posted up in the shower recording a YouTube video right now is crazy. Are people doing this? Are your other favorite YouTubers doing this? Okay, I'm gonna shave down there and uh, I'm gonna come back to y'all, okay? Because I don't think that y'all need to see that. Okay, I'm literally naked right now trying to moisturize, but look at this, okay? Look. When I tell you I actually think that this vanilla whatever is the best smelling thing ever You guys need to try the shave cream mixed with this because I'm not lying when I say I'm actually their biggest fan I'm not like babes. I ran out. I'm about to open this cap up. Come out. Come out wherever you are. Come on Let's go Ugh, There we go. Love you Eos. I actually love this sponsor. Okay. Bye <laughs> Tell them to sit. Oh, he caught it so cute. I'm gonna be so for real. This was supposed to be such a productive vlog today, but time is currently five o'clock and I've done nothing. It is also raining. And you know what? I was trying to think, I'm like, why am I so L-A-Z-Y? And I think it's because I don't think that I look great right now. And I know you're probably like, no, my God, my, like, don't be. You know, when you just don't look good, you don't feel good. Like my eyebrows are not shaven. So even if I tried doing my makeup, it wouldn't look good because I ran out of razors and I have a pimple on my eyebrow and I'm also on my period. So it's just like, meh, like I don't want to record a video. I don't want to do anything. <sighs> but the thing is it's Sunday, the week's about to start. It's about to be such a busy week. I also just have things on my mind, like with work and stuff. And like, whenever you feel like you don't know the answer to something, don't you just feel like it clogs up your brain. You don't know what to do because that's me right now, but I'm trying not to let it affect me, but it's very hard, but we still have a lot of things to do and you know what I think would fix my mood is if I go and buy bedding because I feel like bedding changes your entire room up right now I have these tatami mats which listen it was great for a month but I think I'm ready to go back to a regular mattress so I think I want to go do that and then I also want to go get groceries with my mom just so that we have food for the week so I don't go out and eat and then I also want to go to dessert spot with her and just hang out with her because I feel like I've been very mean to her lately not actually mean but I've just went on my period and coming back from travel and stuff it's like I don't want to talk like I don't I rather Rather not talk you know what I mean and like I feel bad because I'm like not really talking to her and maybe when I get back I'll have some motivation to set up my bed declutter maybe a little bit I don't know I just feel like I have such a Gorgina home that I've just not really been looking at but look at how Gorgina this tree is looking and then also with the city in the back oh she's looking gorgeous and Sterling's new haircut he looks like a famous dog he looks like the dog boot but I would also like to try to tackle organizing my closet today because these are all the new clothes that I bought in LA and then I have some more over here so I would like to be able to like organize my closet so that I'm excited coming in here putting on new outfits honestly can I be honest with you guys I think I'm I'm really scared that I'm getting yeah that word and I know you're probably like ooh, jump scare but yeah it's a jump scare to me too because it's just been like four days in a row now of me just being like 
a doing nothing and it kind of scares me because that's the worst feeling ever and i don't wish it upon anybody so i really need to try to get myself back on track and i know the only thing to do that is actually get up and do things which it's hard it's easier said than done also this is another alchemy sample we sized this tree down by quite a bit and like made the colors less vibrant but this is a really cute hoodie pink toes pink toes she's been begging to do my nails like i was laying down petting the dogs and she started shaving them and cutting them and everything and i was literally just laying down i don't know currently on brooklyn and website because i put on my spam account because i don't know if i should to go for like fun kid bright just something differently you know i feel like i would walk into my room and feel just like a little bit like a kid again or if i should go for like ooh, she's so aesthetic clean she i don't know though I'm trying to decide you ready want something for summer this is super cute but then also this is super cute but i think i really love this one how it's like colorful and then you can also have this side this is the one i was looking at online but i feel like i'm gonna get sick of this really fast there's also this one here which is really cute Ooh, this one could be really nice but i don't think that it matches my aesthetic like that you know like it's very dark and it's cool but i just don't think it's me like these are the two vibes and i can't decide I'm like spam account sos i don't know someone on the spam just said don't listen to them gray is giving sad and depressing i think it's a sign that i should not do that okay well that was a flop i'm not loving any of them i'm not gonna force myself to buy a 200 sheet set that i don't even like so we're gonna go oh no the place is basically closed so she can only get a couple things but we'll come back here tomorrow oh no nah, they really shut the lights off they said go home I think we do more, oh, more like it than usual. I, I look say. like the younger sister right now. <laughs> you know? So currently we're at Lost Tacos. You already know. And we're eating. I got the cactus one for the first time, and she got the atabata. You gave me order it. I was like, that I do bad. No, bad, me. Bad, bad. The first time I came here, I didn't know how to say it either. Whenever I don't know how to pronounce things, I get so scared. It's just like speaking in my chest. Okay, I'm with Mercedes right now. She said she's been walking through my vlog since what? High school? Literally. Yeah. No, she saw me get kicked out and everything like that. <laughs> and I'm 22 now. Girl grew up with me. She grew up with me. Basically, you raised me. No, facts. I took Haley to the spot. You already know if you guys watch the New York vlog, this is the spot. I got a watermelon. What do you get? Uh, pineapple mango. Mm. Pineapple no, coconut. coconut. Yeah. It is the next morning. I just ran 10 kilometers and I didn't even mean to. It's because I had an ice cold brew because I was filming another video, which was PR unboxing haul. But then that made me have a lot of energy. So when I hopped on the treadmill, hops on the plane and LAX. When I hopped on the treadmill, I just had so much energy. So I don't run 10 kilometers every single day. It was just, it was a feel good day. But, bro, I'm actually so angry right now. Like, there's no reason for me to be so angry. But anything that anybody does, like, I'm texting people right now, I'm just getting so angry for no reason like i actually am just angry like my mom just brought me food and for some reason i'm angry and it's because i haven't ate like i just burned a thousand calories and i have not ate yesterday i hung out with pool boy and for some reason like after i hang out with a boy the next day i'm like so i don't know guys like it's a love-hate relationship like whenever i hang out with boys it's so distracting but that's only if i like them i'm not saying like i'm hanging out with boys that i don't like but it's like if i'm like head over heels with someone then that's when it's dangerous that's why you got to talk to a bunch of people at once so that like you're just like busy you know and you're like oh like whenever i get the chance i'll hang out with you because when you're only talking to one person that becomes dangerous because then they occupy your mind because and you're like, oh, what are they doing? Anyway, so I'm with boy yesterday. That's why I'm so motivated today. I think I need therapy, first of all. Mm, let's put that on the to-do list. But I wrote on my to-do list before he came over because I was like, I gotta make sure I'm on my tomorrow. That's what I mean, like, just like, 
motivated. I wish I could do this. I mean, I can do this without a boy, but it's just easier when there's a boy. But this is my to-do list, and this is my alchemized to-do list, because alchemized is dropping on the 21st. There's so much to do. But look, guys. My mom made me some food, so this is what we're going to be eating today. I'm very excited, because I definitely need to eat before I actually punch somebody. Like, there's no reason for this anger. Like, you may be thinking, like, oh my god, like, what's going- no, nothing. This is tofu and vegetables. Protein, get your protein in. What outfit are we gonna wear today? I wanna go into the city and go to dessert spot with my mom. I definitely don't need to eat dessert, but I just really wanna go eat a dessert spot with my mom, okay? Listen, I was supposed to go to the other day, but we got in a car accident. I didn't show the car accident because who knows, what if I have to go to court? It was criminal. It was a hit and run, the car smoked and like, it was crazy. It was like a police chase. Anyway, so we didn't get to go out to eat. So I really wanna do with her, do that with her today. I wear this grand army shirt that was thrifted. And then I'm also gonna wear these big, baggy old pants okay i think i want to go to target to try to find bedding because brooklyn was a flop yesterday like it was a flop i think they have good options but it's just all online and i was trying to convince myself that i liked the things yesterday but i was literally lying to myself anyways this is a sample for alchemy we're just trying different production places you know too thin way too thin this is not it i'm such a hater but the reason why is because i've said it so many times but alchemy's fabric is a custom cut and sew fabric so it's like nobody has the same fabric so you have to like basically mill it to perfection and i've never felt a fabric like alchemy's before so it's like whenever people try to replicate it when i say people like ma manufacturers i'm always so disappointed i mean for the first try it's not bad could be worse but the fabric is just not it like it's not as soft and cozy like at all flop i mean it was a good try anyways okay so we're gonna head out to target and then we're also gonna head out to dessert spot i want to go get me bedding at target and i also just want dessert Hi, babies. we decided to go on walks you so cute Gucci. All right, right now we're at Martha's Country Bakery. I got a cake here, DoorDash, for my birthday, and it was so good, so we're back here again. Yes, babes, I'm a dessert gal, okay? I've been craving dessert. I feel like out of all the things to make me happy, it's dessert right now, so. Yeah. I'm also really excited to get bedding. I feel like once my bedding is set up in my bed, I'm gonna feel so much better. Like, I just feel like my home isn't giving home right now to me. so light it's like spongy strawberry shortcake is my favorite cake i love it because it's so light and it's like not that sweet you know okay so we just finished eating at the dessert spot now we're headed to a pho place because i'm just craving pho i mean my mom where's my mom She's like, I forgot. She could definitely make pho, but I'm just like, I want it right now. So that's what we're gonna get. We're gonna do a taste test and see if it's better than hers. All right, we're gonna add the lime, the mint. Let's try the broth. L'aqua. She's gonna go ask for more fish sauce, giving week. Mm, I love pho. Pho is like probably one of my favorite foods. Vietnamese cuisine is my favorite. It's just so fresh. I would say Italian comes second and then Greek. I love like Mediterranean food, so good. Like the fish, Greek salad, but you know what? I don't like olives. All right, we in Target. If you're wondering why I'm not doing like any opening shots showing like where I am, it's because with the sponsor, I can't show like brand logos. So if you're wondering why this video is like not transitioning the way it transitions, that's why. But I don't want to buy too many groceries since I'm leaving this Friday, but I do want to get frozen fruit though to make smoothies because it's just such a good way to get protein in is by just drinking a smoothie with protein powder. <gasps> Home decor, I literally, do, I do need some. I just like, I don't know if I want to buy from Target, you know? I used to be obsessed with Target's home decor. All right, we're in the bedding section right now. I'm trying to pick out bedding. I'm more of a duvet gal instead of a comforter. When I was growing up, I was a comforter gal because I didn't know the difference. This is a comforter. A comforter is basically like already a blanket that's filled. And I think to wash it, it's like just a little bit harder. Like you're not, I mean, if people do wash these, but personally what I like to do is get an actual, not my mom just recording back. What I like to do is just, is just get a duvet off of Amazon. I'll link my two favorites down below. And during the winter, I put a comforter and a duvet into a duvet cover and then in the summer i only use one because it's a little too heavy but it's literally it makes your bed so fluffy and it's the best night's sleep ever because basically your bedding is weighted but i'm personally a duvet gal which basically means that you have a cover that you put on top of it and every time you wash it since i like to wash my bedding every like two weeks every week or so you just basically take the top sheet off of it and then you wash it i'm that kind of gal but i think
think I'm gonna go for this one. You guys can see it's kind of like it's giving raw. It's also like half the price, even cheaper than the ones yesterday. Something I've also realized a lot after moving out and moving in sometimes is don't waste your money on pillows. If a pillow is over $35, don't do that. Just spend money on like um a a what is it called? A pillow cover and then go buy cheap pillows. But I think I'm gonna get <laughs> me just saying that, but I'm like, mm, I'm gonna get one though. But I'm looking at these pictures and I'm like, oh, do people do that? I'm like, let me try that. Ready to go home? Yes. Bruh. It's totally master tired. Nice. Good job. Yay. Alright, we've got new bedding. Now I have to build up the and do this thing. All right, so time is currently 11.20. You can hear the fireworks still going off. I'm about to journal, but I want to show you guys what the bed looks like. I think it's super, super, super cute. I had a king size mattress before. That's why this bedroom seems so much bigger now. I actually wanted my parents to keep the king size and then I'll just have the full. And I think it works out better anyways because I think that this bedroom is so beautiful and like when it was a king, it took up the whole thing. So you couldn't even tell what bedroom it is. I got this off Facebook Marketplace. It is the Floyd bedroom though. But I know a lot of people sell that type of bed frame on Facebook, so check that out. But I was so tired today. There's so many more things that I wish I could have done, but I was so, so, so tired. I think it was from running the 10K, but also from eating meat. Meat makes me so tired. Like I can feel it in my chest whenever I eat meat. Like literally my left tit, I always know the feeling that I get whenever I eat meat. I'm gonna journal. I really wanna journal every single night. I mean, I have been. I love journaling. But I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's my first time actually doing an outro in a long time. And if you guys did, make sure to subscribe and comment down below. I love to read every single one of my comments. Bye. East and the West, I'm racking up on my breath. Uh, power on me, I'm feeling just like a Tesla. Too much treat, the smoke is making my chest hurt. Girl on me, I'm thinking I should arrest her. Hey, I'm thinking I should arrest. All night long, she putting me to the test. Got a lot on, I'm trying to take out the rest. Couldn't know my lines, I'm sending them but the best.